Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets review video. In this video, we have the Logitech C920 HD webcam. So what makes this webcam unique is it has a stereo microphone. It also features full HD, so that's 1080p. It also has autofocus, so it could do face tracking, things like that. All that for only about $50 on Amazon, so check the link in the description to find that price. Let's go ahead and open it up and check it out. It comes in a nice cardboard box. I like that because you can recycle it. In the box, we have a quick start guide and then some safety information. After that, it looks like we just have this cardboard box that contains the webcam and cable. So I'll get that out of there. My first impression is this has a really nice weight to it. It feels very sturdy and well-built. Also looks really cool. I love the face on this, kind of all glass with a nice lens right there, very protective of that. And then it looks like you have the microphones on each side and that's gonna give you that stereo audio quality. Nice little Logitech logo with the HD 1080p right there, pretty cool looking. And then in the back here, this is where the cable comes out. So that's perfect for mounting it to a monitor or a laptop or anything like that. On the bottom here, as you can see, the mount kind of just opens up. And the way this mount works is the lip right here will be on the front of the monitor. And then it will kind of use the weight of this little hinge right here to have it firmly stick to your monitor or your laptop. And then you can adjust the angle of the webcam. It only goes up and down surface right here is completely rubber so that's going to add some grip as well as right here on the bottom which will add some grip to the back of the monitor it looks like you can even angle up the rubber grip on the back of it to make it fit different shapes and areas like that that's pretty cool another way you can mount it looks like there's a standard tripod mount on the bottom of this so you could put this on top of a tripod maybe a little mini tripod that's flexible you could hang it somewhere and videotape somewhere like that that's pretty cool really like that they added that option I currently have a c270 which is a 720p webcam and it does not have that option so i'm really excited about having this ability to film just about anywhere with this device as you can see right here the mount gets very wide so you don't have to worry about this not fitting your monitor or your laptop or wherever you want to place it this is going to fit very well Looking at the cable here, it is about five feet long, so you're not gonna have any problems getting this mounted and plugged into your computer. It is a standard USB, so that's gonna be compatible with Windows computers or Mac, anything like that. You won't have any problem with that. That's very compatible. So now that we've taken a closer look at the Logitech C920, let's go ahead and get it plugged into my computer. We'll get it set up, and then I'll do a comparison video between this, the C270, and then also the webcam that came up with my computer, so you can just see the difference in quality. So per the quick start guide, it says to first mount this to your computer or tripod, anything like that. I'll show you how I mount it to a Chromebook, but I'll be mounting it on my laptop permanently. And then to just plug it into your computer, go to this URL right here, and it'll have that in the description. And that's where we can find the software to download to get this to work with your computer. So right now I'll show you how this mounts using my Chromebook as an example. So you want this lip right here that's on the webcam to go over the laptop that faces you. And then you push the mounting bracket right here towards the laptop and it'll hold in place. After that, you can angle the webcam up and down for your desired filming location. Then you just plug this cable into your computer and you're good to go. But as you can see, the bracket can fit a large monitor as I was saying earlier with no issue. Now we just need to get it plugged into my computer and then go to this website right here. All right, so I have the Logitech C920 plugged into my computer and I've gone to the website that was provided in the quick start guide. All you need to do once you get here is just scroll down until you see downloads. We'll click that. Then just go down until you see the drop down right here. Make sure you select the OS you have. I have Windows 10, but it'll detect if you're on a Mac or a Windows computer and then give you options from there. So I'm gonna select Windows 10 and then I'll go to download now. After that, just select save and it will begin downloading your computer. Once it's done downloading, open it up and then we can begin the installation process. Now to install, we just need to accept the terms and conditions from Logitech and it will begin installing it to your computer. And then once you're done, just go ahead and select finish. So now the Logitech C920 has been installed to your computer, the drivers have been installed, so you can use it with any application you want to. The next step is going to be to go to the start menu, find Logitech, and then go ahead and open up the camera settings. Once you open up the Logitech webcam settings, the webcam will turn on and you'll actually see the video from the webcam. From here we can play with the webcam and zoom in, zoom out, and then kind of pan if we want to, anything like that, it's pretty crazy. Then we can go to advanced and do some other changes if we want to do that. So you can change things such as the brightness and color intensity. Most of these can be just left default though, you shouldn't have a problem there. 
All right, so this is a quick comparison. I wanted to show you three different webcams, including the C920, which I have in the left side at the top, and then the C270, which is a $20 webcam. I've been using it for about the last two years for all of my tutorial videos, and I've really enjoyed it, but I wanted that full HD capability. At the bottom, just for a comparison, I have the built-in camera that came with my laptop. The angle's a little bit weird on that, but I just wanted to give you an idea of the quality. Hopefully, with the colors of my hat, you can kind of see the different colors that come through with these different webcams. As you can see when I move a little bit, that this C920 does a great job of actually picking that up. There's no blurring or anything from the movement. The C270 has a lot of issue with that. Also, the autofocus on the C920 works very well. If I put my hand up here, you can kind of see that it'll quickly autofocus, where with the 270, it doesn't do that at all. There is no autofocus. So as I bring it back, the camera will try to figure it out and it'll get that autofocus pretty quick. That's pretty impressive. Also, another thing to keep in mind, all the audio you're currently hearing is coming from the stereo microphone on the Logitech C920. As you can see in the video comparisons, the video quality is really not too different. It's not like the 270 is horribly different, but there are minor differences that will make the quality of your video a lot better with the 920. So I do feel that it's worth that extra about $30 to get the full HD and the higher quality camera. Another thing I want to point out is the really cool blue LED lights that are on the C920. Very cool looking and it's very easy to see, hey look, my camera's on and I'm actually recording. All right, so that was the Logitech C920. Overall, very impressed with this product. For a price of only around $50 to $60, you get the full HD capability, along with the stereo microphone, and it's very easy to install to your computer. It's also compatible with Mac and Windows, so no compatibility problems with the two main computer platforms. As you saw in the video comparison, the video between this and the C270, which is a cheaper $20 webcam from Logitech, is definitely a lot different. This, this webcam, the C920, does look a lot better with its full HD capability abilities and it also does a great job with movement and autofocus so as you move your hands or get closer or farther away from the camera it's going to autofocus so that you're always in focus and as you saw if anything's moving while you're recording it it's not going to have a problem with that another thing i liked is it's very easy to mount it also can fit very large monitors and i also like that it has the ability to be mounted to a tripod i think that adds a lot of versatility to it one area that i was a little bit disappointed in was the stereo microphones i thought that the quality could be a lot better and i was a little bit disappointed for the price of 60 dollars compared to the microphone on the Logitech C270. Really not a big difference there. And other than that, it's very easy to install the provided software from Logitech to your computer so that you can go ahead and start using it in just about five to 10 minutes. One quick thing, if you plan on using this webcam for streaming on Twitch or anything like that, check the links in the description. I have some tutorials on how to get started with that, so hopefully those will help you. If you have any questions about the Logitech C920 HD webcam, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I'm going to add an Amazon affiliate link to the description below so you can find this exact device on Amazon. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up. And please consider subscribing to my channel, Engaging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.